For our final step, we'll connect the template with a product in our store. Go to Link Products to select a product from your store and assign a template to it. By clicking Choose Template, you'll be able to connect the product with a template from your list. In this case, choose one of your monogram templates. Once the template is assigned, we will create the options customers will use to make their choices. These are the dropdowns, swatches, and text inputs customers will see on your store. Simply name the option set for this product and it will be assigned to it automatically. You can see the created option set in gray. Let's save the product and check how it looks in the store. Options for the initials are looking good. However, we can change each initial's color separately. This is because Customly will automatically create a color option for each text layer of the template. But don't worry, we can manually adjust that so all initials will change colors at the same time. Let's go to Option Sets and click to edit the option set we just created, so we can have just one monogram color option. Let's find the second and third initial color options and delete them. Now let's make sure that when customers change the color options, all three initials will change. Expand the first initial color option and open its functions. It already has the function to change the color of the text with ID 1, which is the first initial. So let's add two more functions for it to change the color of the text with ID 2 and 3, which are the second and third initials. Let's change the label of the option so it's clear it will change the color of the entire monogram. Drag and drop options to change their order. The only thing remaining is to include the option to choose from our different monogram styles. So let's add a new option, a swatch for customers to choose their monogram style. We'll assign to the option the function to change templates. Then create the values for the swatch. In each value we will choose a thumbnail to use for the swatch. In this case, I'll use some example monograms, but you can use any images you prefer. Choose a template that will load for this value, and repeat with the other monogram styles. Let's check how the product looks with these updates. And, there it is. We have the monogram style option, as well as a single color option that will change the color of the entire monogram. Now go ahead and try it yourself. If you have any questions, click the link below to visit our help center. Goodbye, and happy customizing!